I'm standing outside the Eagle and Child pub in Oxford. This is where, in the 1930s and 40s, the Inklings used to meet. C.S. Lewis, J.R.R. Tolkien, Charles Williams and their friends. They used to read each other's new work, discuss literature, theology, everything under the sun and beyond it on Tuesday and Thursday mornings. Now, C.S. Lewis and J.R.R. Tolkien are well-known names and there are many books about them. But who was Charles Williams, the third member of the group? Williams was in many ways the most complex and the most mysterious of the three. He was a pioneer writer of fantasy fiction. He was probably the 20th century's major English poet of the Arthurian legends. He was an influential Anglican Christian theologian. But he was also connected with the occult. He was from a poor background and held left-wing views very different from other members of the Inklings. A most extraordinary character who somehow has fallen through the cracks of history. A central figure of the Inklings and yet there has never been a proper biography of him. I've been interested in Charles Williams for a long time. First of all captivated by his fiction, then drawn into the beautiful, rich and intricate world of his Arthurian poetry. And for the past 20 years or so, I've been gathering material for a proper life of this remarkable man and writer.